Two games in a row now, Kyle's made huge plays. Um, you look at his stats, he goes six for 19, so obviously not a great shooting night for a good scorer. I thought he missed a lot of clean looks, uh, as good as Quinnipiac's defense was on him. I credit those guys, they did a great job defensively. But he made the biggest one of the game, and you know what, sometimes as a coach, you're like, should you call a timeout to run a set play, give the defense a chance to actually set up there, whatever they want to do defensively, or just let a good player like Kyle just go. And we let him go versus, um, for Sacred Heart the other day, and it, it worked out well. And once again, he wants the ball in crucial times. As a freshman, he would miss that shot, and I think he's grown up a little, and he wants the ball, and now he's capitalizing. Great, huge shot. I thought Malcolm and Joe gave us a huge offensive uh, boost in the first half when, when Matt wasn't really um, assertive. Uh, I thought Matt was just tentative a little in the first half, and Kyle wasn't really um, productive either. So I thought Malcolm, you know, him playing the lane was a big big bonus for us, and obviously I thought Joe played a good first half as well. Um, that's the catch-22. You know, you love to say we're going to just break it um, if you can rebound, but you can't rebound, you know, and you almost have to keep five around, and they just crash. And as he said, even before the game, sometimes their best offense is just a missed shot, especially on a free throw. They do such a good job, they must practice it down routinely because uh, – it's the best. I've been coaching for a while, and it's the best rebounding team I've seen. Even if we play tomorrow or the next day, we're still not a, you know, they're going to be a better rebounding team. You know, we're not as big as them. They're athletic. Uh, we have to beat them in other ways. We try to double in the post limit some of their post touches. And their guys did a good job early. I thought of kicking it out to some open threes, and then I thought we did better with our rotations as the game went, uh, as the game went on. Um, and that, once again, you know, I, I thought we got some good contributions to some guys. And Brandon, this was a good game for Brandon to see the size of these guys. He didn't get, really get a chance to play them the first time around either.